welcome back to Kyle Frontline J here with another review. Today I'm reviewing Green Lantern number 38. The title of this issue is Leave. It is written by Robert Venditti, art by Admira Wujaya, and colors are by Andrew Dollhouse. Now, this issue starts off with Hal Jordan facing the Templar um, Guardians. And they tell him, you know, you did some great things while you were leader of the court, like... You know, you defeated the Outer Clans, and, you know, you saved everyone, including Kyle Rayner. But then they tell him all the bad things he's done. Like, let Oa explode, and the reputation that the Green Lanterns have right now. So they tell him he has to go. He has to take um, some leave and go home for a while. So Hal Jordan has to Earth, but he's met by Guy Gardner, who tells him, you know, uh-uh. This is my turf now. Hal's like, dude, I'm not trying to take over your turf. I'm just going to land as Green Lantern, live, leave as Green Lantern. In between, I'm just going to be Hal Jordan, test pilot. He's like, all right, but give me a ring. Hal Jordan's like, nah, nah, not happening. Guys, all right, keep your nose clean. And he goes off. Hal Jordan lands. He goes to Ponto's, a bar outside of Coast City. And, um, you know, he has some drinks. In walks Guy Gardner because he invited himself and he decides, you know, he wants to have fun with um, Green, um, Hal Jordan and share his, you know, time with them. And he tells Hal how everything's been with him, you know, how some of the Red Lanterns have died and how he, you know, thinks the Red Lanterns get a bad rep and these are some of the best Lanterns that he's ever worked with. Then in comes Barry Allen who, you know, him and Guy are playing pool. Guy's kind of pissed because Barry's wiping Guy's face in pool. And then um, he's not doing it with straight shots. He's doing like these geometry, you know, he's using geometry, science, and math, and all that stuff to make these trick shots like off of like five different um, sides and then into the opposite pocket. And, you know, Guy Garner's like, can't you just take a straight shot, dude? But it's a great chemistry and great scene there. Um, Barry Allen starts to talk to um, Hal and tells him all his problems that he's facing with, you know, from the crime syndicate. This is obviously takes place before Vin Diddy's work on um, Flash. So we don't have the blue Flash. This is regular Barry Allen. Now, um... Barry gets a little tipsy and he tells Hal, you know, I admire you, you know, Batman's rich, he doesn't have problems like us, you know, Superman has powers, he can't, you know, be grounded like us, but you, you showed me that, you know, you could be a great superhero and all this, and then there's a fight in a bar, because of course, this guy Gardner in a bar drinking, what made you think this wasn't going to end up in a bar fight? And they get kicked out. Al Jordan gets really pissed. He's like, you know what? You guys kept talking about everything, about your problems. Did you ever stop for a second and think why I'm here? Why I'm at this bar? It's because I just want to be a part of my old life. Before I met the Justice League, before I had this ring, before I became a space cop, I want to be just Hal Jordan's test pilot and drown my sorrows in beer. You never once asked me how my life's going. The universe is a big place, you know, and I'm in charge of it all. And they're like, whoa, dude, you know. And he's like, and I'm not a perfect guy. You know, I got flaws. And then in walks um, um, Carol. And she tells him, you know, they sit down, they have a nice little talk where she basically says, you need to find out who you are. And, you know, they talk about her relationship with Kyle and how Hal feels about it. And we kind of get some hope that they could get back together. And I love that. Um, this was the best book, I think, the best Green Lantern book out there since Jeff Johns left it, which is very high praise. Um, Hal is finally in character. And I've been saying this since Robert Venditti took over. I have not enjoyed his um, Green Lantern run, and I thought it would have been better if he would have grounded Green Lantern on Earth. And 
guess what? He does it here, and guess what? I was right. He, it it hits on all cylinders. This is the best Green Lantern issue. And not only that, but Barry Allen is a lot better than he is over in the Flash book. This issue is just like a great book. Now, the only reason why I'm not going to give this five stars for the story is because I got issue with Barry Allen. He's tipsy in here. But with Barry's powers, he should have burned off the alcohol and never got drunk. So, that's my one issue. I'm giving the story four and a half stars. Art, the art is really good. I like it. Guy looks a lot better than he does over in Red Lanterns. He's still rough and scruffy, but he looks good. Um, Carol looks hot. Hal looks, you know, great. Barry looks great. Great continuity with the art. I love that in art. So I'm giving the art four and a half stars. Overall, best issue of Green Lantern in a long time. And I keep saying that, I know, but it truly is. Robin Venditti actually does his best writing for both Green Lantern and Flash in this one issue. And I'm giving it an overall rating of four and a half stars. And I highly recommend picking it up. If you got turned off by what's been going on in Green Lantern, pick this issue up and you will fall in love with the character again. Because this is what Hal Jordan is. Once again, four and a half stars. And I recommend picking up Green Lantern number 38. Well, those are my thoughts. Now I want to know what yours are in the comments below. Also, like this video, subscribe to Comic Frontline. Check out and subscribe to my channel, The Comic Book Theater. Check out Comic Frontline, the site, for all the latest previews, reviews, news, and interviews. For even more news on all things related to comics, comicrelated.com is your source for all your comic book needs with daily updates. And don't forget to like and follow me and Comic Frontline on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. I'll include all these links in the description below. Until then, I'll catch you in the next review.